Imagine me chilling, throwing dollars at my feelings, trying to mirror what they living. Could have did it, but they just ain't me. Hold back, just in case a brother flip don't reap. Hard pass, got my lane, I remain not the same. Yo, come on, Eric, thanks on that fucking mic. We are currently on our way to the Royal Cornwall Tattoo Convention. We're gonna try sneak in and hopefully get some free tattoos or some cheaper tattoos, shall we say. I'm gonna get a tattoo on my lips, cut. Yo, and not the one on my face, you know what I'm saying? Oh, this guy should we get cut on my fucking foreskin, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, so let's go and do that, shall we? <laughs> shall we try and do that, guys? Sure, like, look at the day, innit? Yeah, crazy out here in Nuki. Weather is shit. We are not entirely sure how we're gonna get in, but it's at the Royal Cornwall where they did the Royal Cornwall festival thing. <laughs> no, festival thing. That's, uh, I can't remember what it was. I don't even know what, Do you know what, what the, the horse race is. I think so. They have like it's sort of it's like a farmers like festival pretty much, and they sell I don't know just random shit. Apparently that's where the tattoo convention is. It's quite like a secure sort of facility, so I don't know how long we're going in here. Oh, if we fail, we'll just come town and get a tattoo. We yeah. won't finish today without a tattoo. That's the mindset. I mean, man's in his overdraft from trying to get tattoos. This is I've brilliant. Got but anyway. It's fine, Leash has savings, she's buying everyone tattoos, that's what she just hey. said. <laughs> cool. uh, We've made it! Wow! Uh, Security's not that on it, so I think we're just gonna walk around the back and we'll probably be into the festival pretty easily, so it's not that crazy. Don't jinx it. Yeah, we ain't gonna jinx it, but it'll not be pretty work. embarrassing if we get kicked out of a <laughs> tiny little festival that's like... I mean, these kids are just gonna show But this is what I mean, there's like little kids just running up and down the hill, around the fence and shit, so I reckon we just walk behind this fence, it'll be sound. If we just take pictures... Okay, just say walk with us so we look like pedophiles. <laughs> <laughs> It's literally just like a road at the back, which Lee and Ryan have just walked through. Easy on there, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Go away now. Oh my god. So as we enter the warehouse, we are greeted by quite a few tattoo artists all showcasing their best tattoo designs and artwork and you are just surrounded by this vibration of sound coming from every tattoo gun or shall I say tattoo machine because I said that on my Instagram video and some of the people weren't happy that I said tattoo gun because it's kind of offensive in the tattoo community I guess so we'll say tattoo machine so yeah there's just all these artists I think there was over around 360 artists and yeah they were all like from the ones I spoke to all of them were super kind and friendly super welcoming they even had a mini ramp and all sorts of stuff and it's day two of tattoo sneak-ins we didn't get <laughs> tattoos yesterday because all of the stations are pretty much booked up pretty much didn't have any like walk-ins available but today is the day where you can just walk in Ryan's got an appointment he's getting his whole back fat the whole back fat down to the <laughs> nipple crease you know what i'm saying <laughs> nah, I mean, nah, but yeah you guys are gonna get to watch you're me gonna witness this guy fucking cry, cry piss shit myself at the <laughs> same time maybe pop a fucking zannies <laughs> No, just the old, just the old huge face. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, we're both slightly very hungover. <laughs> so this is probably the worst day for it. But We're not um, hungover, you are. Yeah, you, hungover's a mindset, mate. <laughs> I'm not even hungover. Sweet, stop the yap, let's go. Boom. You know, my boy. I'm not nervous at all, you are. <laughs> so as Ryan gets prepped to get shot up with some absolute tattoo ink liquid goodness. Yeah, pretty much the backstory on how we come to to meet these Thai people they saw Ryan from a distance and obviously Ryan's Thai so they like immediately got on like a house on fire we just started speaking to them and we realized they were from Wales as well and they knew some of the people I used to skate with back when I was living in Wales which is pretty mental and yeah they were giving us this little herbal smelling calming thing it, it kind of smelled like Vicks it was just crazy out of all the 360 artists and people to choose from to tattoo we were just like drawn to this particular stand. So yeah, it's just crazy how the, the universe sort of works in that sort of way. And there's Ryan getting a little bit of his tattoo, having to chong on this <laughs> Vicks calming thing so he can hold back these tears from being hung over as well as getting a pretty big tattoo. In the end, they invited us to come to Wales to get a free tattoo, which is fucking sick. Cause yeah, we were just speaking to them for like two hours and 
we got on super well with them. I was showing her my stick and poke tattoos and she was super impressed by my line work and stuff and she told me to come to Wales. She wanted to train me up, so she wanted me to come to Wales so she could train me up and then I could potentially just become a sort of tattoo artist myself, which could be super sick. She ended up giving my little tattoo for free, my little love heartbeat thing. So all in all, it was a fucking sick day. Make sure you check their socials at TK Tattoo Kingdom or Tuck Tattoo on Instagram, I think. Um, they're super sick. Please check them out. And yeah, there's me gassed up with my little tattoo. Woo! Yo, Ryan. Spin around like an influencer. Yeah, probably, probably so I've got now. Jeez! <laughs> Yeah. Right on, homies. That's pretty much it for the Cornwall Tattoo Convention here in uh, Way here in Weybridge. <laughs> pretty successful day. Right, got a massive fat tattoo. And I like a bitch. I got <laughs> they just gave me mine for free because I was like, I was speaking to them, and then we realised that we all sort of know some of the same skaters that I used to skate with in Wales. So it was pretty cool, and then I got a free tattoo out of it as well. So the lady was pretty much just like. I don't know, she's just sound, isn't she? She's so just cool. time, the best, Welsh best people. Yeah. Probably the best mixture of people you can get. <laughs> <laughs> They're all so friendly and so kind. Yeah, honestly, but yeah, the she's just people ever. How's yours feeling, my boy? My stinging a little bit. I was a little bit hungover when I started it and I started sweating like. I feel like shit. it's cured my hangover, to be honest. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, mine's only a tiny little yeah. one, but that pain would like woke me up. Like, ah! People say like stick and pokes hurt more, but I think, I don't know. I think stick and pokes hurt I think maybe more. just in that little area. I'm going to shut up now and go home. Ryan's late for work. <laughs> These are things you have to do for tattoos. Sorry, Mark. <laughs> right on. Hope you guys enjoy. See you later.